Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Derek Hodge representing Philadelphia by way of Willemboro, by way of Camden to LA to Denver, Colorado. I'm a hybrid of it all, yo. But you are watching all music television. And it's funny that you mentioned um, post Obama because um, I had a system that was in place on election, particularly the presidential election. And during the Clinton administration, it worked through Obama. Now what the deal was, I basically had to be in some part of Italy during the election and we would get who we want. Now, 1992 and 96, I was in Rome, we got Clinton. So in 1992 and 96, I was in Rome, we basically got Clinton, you know, thought we had, you know, everything that we wanted in uh, a president, you know, and particularly for me, a cat that played saxophone, so he understood my, my sympathetic, you know, lean towards that instrument. Um, 2000 and 2004, I was uh, back in New York, and of course, we got Bush, <laughs> and we got bushed. <laughs> and uh, so fast forward to 2008, I was in Bari, Italy, and uh, Obama came on the scene. And after eight years of Bush, I mention this because of the fact that Obama basically brought out an unprecedented uh, percentage of the American people to vote. I mean, people basically got off of the, uh, came out of the grid, came onto the grid in order to let their voices heard that they're voting for their brother so that there can be some sort of change at least that we're all hoping for. And uh, they came out in unprecedented numbers and got over. And while we were in uh, Italy, there was basically a celebration across the world as far as his election was concerned. There was uh, the sense of hope you know, we were able to come out of our hotel rooms, and our, out of the hotels the following day, and folks were looking at us, yeah, good America's great, this and other, yeah, it's going to work out, democracy is finally going to work, and you know, the brother's in the house, and we're all feeling like, yeah, Obama, Obama's in the house, you know. So fast forward to 2016, and... Um, I called myself doing as best as I could. I was actually in Lugano, Switzerland when the election went down, which is the Italian part of Switzerland. And um, unfortunately, the formula didn't work, <laughs> as we all witnessed. And what you actually expected to happen was Trump came into the house and... <laughs> We as Americans were walking around basically with the crimson letter on our back like and the only way that you could get cooled off was like, who'd you vote for? You know, and we were like, man, I voted for the for such and such, you know, and uh, all right, and, you know. We came back, we didn't know what we were flying back into because we flew back the following day after the election, you know, and Hillary conceded defeat and whatnot, you know, and um, it was just a different era, and uh, you know, and of course with uh, the various things that have gone down since then, I mean, from the building of the proposed wall to, you know, um, various legislature that's been put into effect that's very divisive. Um, it's, it's, this cat's got to go, I mean, and what's even more uh, resonant about it is the fact that um, We've been revisiting some uh, familiar jazz things that, you know, really put out, uh, put the whistle on social injustices. I mean, we've recently uh, revisited Strange Fruit. Um, more recently, uh, Fables of Fathers, that was uh, called Fables of Trumpets for the situation. And uh, a good friend of mine, uh, Dee Dee Jackson, wrote a piece called DFT. And as he puts it, D, of course, stands for Donald. The T stands for Trump. And you can 
make up your mind what the F stands for and all that. But <laughs> bad piece and all, you know. But um, the fact remains that we still, as a people, you know, um, in the midst of it all, we're we're not going anywhere. We, we should have, you know, the the mustard seed faith of Job that you know this too shall pass, you know. And the music will definitely be strong. The people that uh, listen to the music and that are uh, within tune with the music and with the spirit, you know, will definitely rise and, you know, this will be over. You know, and hopefully we'll get back to the point where we have even more of a communion with each other because of this divisiveness that's been brought about, you know, because there's only one way to go. It's up and you got to look up because he does provide.